Hello, viewers. I'm SB. And I'm Amabel. And welcome back to Roundabout, where... It's, listen, we're back. We're in one piece. We've had some minor technical problems. My computer is haunted, and many of its components are slowly dying of old age. Uh, but, we're, but, we're, but we're back. In the big city. Roundabout city. Amabel. Yeah. Are you ready for? Are you ready for that big city life? Yeah. That that nine two five. What a way to make a living. Yep. The, your car can jump now. That's pretty sick. It's, very, it's an extremely natural looking motion. If a car was going to ollie, that's what it would look like. Okay, so we only have the one the one upgrade still. Yeah. Well. We'll fix that. We'll get there. We'll find some more. It'll happen. Just you getting your getting your revolving legs back here a little bit. Yeah. I swear I am I am not going to press any additional buttons just to mess with you. I would never do such a thing. You just did. I knew you'd come around, kid. Look, I've got the perfect plan. Just take me to Chinatown, and I'll take care of the rest. Just, just follow the arrow, Giorgio. Mickey's, Man, this kid sometimes. Mickey's getting a little, a little, a little bossy, a little ownershipy. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that. Oh, there's some money there. Let me try to get this money. This is not his idea. This is not his revolving business. That was pretty smooth. Well done. Yeah. This is a pretty tricky business, though. You know, I hear the turnaround is murder. Amabel. Yeah. Seven out of ten. Beautiful. Really well done. <laughs> okay. Was that the maneuver? You know, or you know what? You know what? No. Eight. Eight out of ten. Oh no, I'm just referring to the quip. Okay. The execution of the maneuver dur during the quip was also pretty pretty great, though. You know, I'm I'm getting the hang of this. This is my point. This is what I'm saying. You're really coming around. Another thing I like, um, I like a lot about this this pumpkin, is that with the rotation, no one is safe from its deathly gaze. Yeah. That's you may think you could just stand on the other side of the car, but no. No, Jack is coming to look at you. Well, that's, oh, that's, that's the ceiling thing. Okay. Yeah, there's like a little arch. There's a transparent it's, it's, yeah, it's kind of like par partly transparent because it would be blocking the camera otherwise. Those are very like watching you watching you sort of like, um, like a cat really. Get down and prepare yourself, and then just hurl yourself into that wall. Was very fun. Me, and this city will be yours good. Good. I'm glad. I live to entertain. Just you the man specifically. I Got a job. That I, still, I still don't entertain your viewers. So, listen. Nobody's perfect. So, uh, before you start this next mission, uh, the way Mickey's yeah. the way Mickey's talking now, is he is he is Mickey organized crime? I think so. I okay. mean, let me tell you, my experience. What is he getting I us involved a, in? I come from a family that does a lot of mechanics. Like, there are a lot of people who are, like, auto shop people. Mm -hmm. They're all criminals. It's all organized crime. It's, it's... Hi, quick, quick. Let's get going. Oh, look yeah, at that hat. It's a matter of life and death. Go. Yep, the hat is definitely the thing, the thing to notice in that moment. What I mean, what else? I let's just say I don't think Giorgio's expression was because of the hat. When you when we see her again, we'll just. I go. mean, Giorgio. No offense. I think Giorgio is shit taste in hats. Ooh. Where are we? Where are we I going? I take hats very seriously. I'm sorry. Are we Are we done with the mission? Did we decide we don't like the mission, or? No, I just I was getting the. Okay. All right. No one. And now that you mention it, not real life. 
So here's what's going to happen. Okay. Yeah, because like the circle's right there. Seems awesome. seems quite easy to touch. Well, maybe not death, but. I think uh, you played the voice lines out of order by approaching this area from the back. I'm, I'm sorry. That's, uh, <laughs> that's not my fault. No, that's not your fault. That's not how that should be triggered. Wait, I can jump. You can, in fact. Wow, okay. Oh. Just all the way up onto wow. the building. Didn't mean to do that. I mean, honestly, though, it doesn't seem like a terrible strategy. Okay, I'm just I'm just doing a a job now. Okay, <laughs> you certainly are doing a job. I can do this. I this this is easy peasy. The thing about the this peasy is that it's easy. Yeah. What is a peasy? Ah, uh, that's a good question. There we go. Oh, like move. excellent move. Excellent. Sort of. Well, I mean, sort of, sort of. <laughs> Do not start me back in that alley. You've got to watch where you're jumping. <laughs> yeah. But no, or that was that was legitimately it. good. You like talked the, you talked the end as you were moving, and you're getting it. The jumping thing, not so much, but the other stuff is coming yeah, along. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't jump. You know, if he, if I, I, you know, I don't think it would be a bad idea to sort of restrict yourself to the ground. Most drivers do it, and they seem to be doing pretty well. If people were meant to jump, okay, yeah, um, we would would have like Mario vertical leaps. We don't. City Hall, that's one hundred percent right. I have no idea what she's talking about anymore. We've we've separated her dialogue by far too much. Perfect. Let's do this. What is in that box? Is she supposed to be shouting through a megaphone, but somehow actually quieter than when she just speaks her lines normally? Yeah. Okay. Look, I'm, they're, I'm le not they're leaflets. It's a box full of leaflets. I'm not saying this game has um, some production choices that are maybe not the most well thought out. No, of course not. Who would ever say that? Three times, three times. You know, you do lose the combo if you hit stuff. Yeah, no, I know that. Thank you. Okay. Do I want? Wait, which way do I? Which way do you think is best to approach? This, it? this is the way you want to be. Okay. Because you got to like you, you imagine, yeah, you imagine the car sort of driving on its own. We did good today. We did a real good thing. <laughs> what I like about that is the conviction. That you can see in her eyes. Do you, do you want to do the optional? Dear chauffeur, the roundabout military is pleased to advise you of advanced weapons testing occurring in your area within the next 10 seconds. Not being killed by said advanced <laughs> weaponry would be most appreciated. Love, General SS Bombsworth. Okay, that's, that's a pretty good... Uh... Okay, that's a fun bit. Don't get hit by these cars. How do you... Okay, I see. There's there's shadows. Drop shadows. Oh. Well, you didn't get hit by the cars, but I think dying at all is the... Yeah. Okay. That's... Uh, did you see the world, rest... world record time there? No, I didn't. See, these are just these are just people I know. If you hit uh, control, hit control again. Okay, what am I looking at? The score? Oh, uh, that's twenty-seven hours. <laughs> Why? I. It might be hacked. But also, but also, maybe maybe somebody found a spot where the cars just can't hit you. Yeah. Also, walked away from it for a day. See, I I am too busy to do that. I have too much time, too little time to do things like this. 
It does not surprise me this person's username begins with the word sis. Oh. Okay, going straight down here. Yeah, easy. Right. Ah, hello again, my revolving fellow. I'm late for my inspection of the Maximilian Tower's construction site. Chop chop. Now, I know everyone calls Giorgio fellow, and I think I think when the narrator referred to Giorgio previously, the pronouns used was they. Yeah. So do we have a non-binary legend that we, we are playing as? That sounds pretty neat. You know, I haven't I haven't asked Giorgio, but I suspect that if you were to ask, you would not receive a very useful answer. No. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Smash yourself into something. Yeah. Yeah. Try it again. Well, one thing we know about this building yes, is that it can stand up to the weight of a car. I can't even see what that blasted mayor disliked. To the alley, geez. Ah. Um. <laughs> Some very solid checkpointing. It does. It does seem like it. Um. It's maybe like dragging you from the position you died to where you should respawn, but it's respawning you before it gets you all the way to where you're going sometimes. Uh. Uh. Oh, oh, okay. For example. That's fine. You don't even need a front right wheel. Yeah. It's one of the least Whatever. important parts of a car. Where on earth are you going? I'm trying to go. To, there's money down that way. Okay. Well, I see. Okay. The... Okay. The siren song of filthy lucre. Well, well done. Smooth moves. For a while there. Yeah. Alright, you got the money. At least I got, I Are got you prepared money. to die again? I'm glad they don't keep track of my deaths in this, because that would be very... Oh, hard. I'm sure they do. Why would they do that? Those ones weren't my fault. It's like a two-for-one sale. for your discretion this whole construction fatalities matter i'm sure this fine suitcase will set things straight onwards jeeves it's time for a well-earned vacation on my yacht <laughs> someone is reading his lines off cue cards that only have about four words each on them could not be bothered to learn them ahead of time Ugh. west roundabout is so gaudy Barely can stand passing through. I like that it was called Studio 360. Get it? Yeah. yeah. Amabel, do you get it? Yeah, so please explain it to me. Well, they say explaining a joke is like, um... Thank you kindly, Jeeves. I'll just wait here for my yacht. Kelly ho pip-pip, cha-ta, and all that. Is this character supposed to be British? Um, I'm not sure. Anyway, explaining a joke is like kissing a frog. Uh, in that... It's not being French people. It's... <laughs> wow. I would like to apologize to our one French viewer. Wait, 
How does he even hear what I'm saying? None of that's important right now, young mademoiselle. What is important is that your revolving amour is trespassing on Ronaldo country. Hey, Giorgio invented revolving. You think stealing it is gonna achieve anything? You'll never be as good as Giorgio. Ho oh, ho! I'm already the best, and I'll prove it. Just try and beat me to upper roundabout. This shall be uproarious. You got this, baby. Teach this Eiffel turkey a lesson. <laughs> she can hardly not smile at the incredible amount of effort being put in by her co-star. Yeah. I've also, never I've never seen someone try to say a word as hard as that woman tried to say Eiffel Turkey. We also apologize to our, our friend viewer for the, the game's uh, anti-friend. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Here's the fucked up thing. Eiffel Turkey is not even... He's French-Canadian, not like French-French. And dude, I don't know if the French are known for for turkey as as a as a dish. Well, no, I don't. I think it's you know just like a turkey in sort of a jive sense. You have to remember the period. That's just period lingo. It's a good thing you did all that falling car training. While the pedestrian right of way laws may be lax around about. Destroying someone's car is tantamount to Oh wait, hang on. So whose car? What is? What is it that's supposed to be happening here, where there are cars falling on you? Is that Ronaldo trying to trying to yeah. fall on you and and failing? Or I, I think the idea is he is driving and running cars off the road. He's driving other cars. people off the road. Okay. Wow, you, you really like wrapped all the way around that. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna do better this time. Okay. I believe in you. <laughs> Congratulations. What a good and critically important time to be doing this. What else am I gonna? No, it's fine. You're not racing or anything. You're not trying to beat someone to up a roundabout as we speak. Okay, if he gets up there first, it's my fault. Okay. And I will I will apologize to you and the viewers. What's over here? Alright you. Oh, I won't go on the other one. Okay. I mean, I think you can probably make it up there going either way, but the key is to not drive as hard as you can into that rock. I'm not trying. That, I'm yeah, that, trying. don't, don't, yeah, from here, don't go up right, just go up. Or jump, yeah, jumping is good. I'm not going that fast. <laughs> yeah, it's a, good, it's a good thing Beth is explosion proof. We got what? Also, her her hat. Yeah. Very good. Then I was I was going to ask for a rating. Right. I got a Bonza soccer game going up north. <laughs> <laughs> up north, take me for a ride up to the park. That's his fault. He said Bonza. I don't know Jeez, what Bonza man. means. I was gonna show no, neither does anyone else. Whatever. May as well play around. Wait, do I not know what Chukasiki means, or does he not? I mean, I don't know what it means. Is, is, is it vomiting? It is vomiting, yes. It's... 
I think. It's, it sounds to me like he thinks it's a it's a sort of a voluntary act. He was considering vomiting and then he was like, nah, I'll do this instead. Just uh, chuck the ball in one of those goals over there. Cheers, mate. Yeah, fucking soccer. Woo. Sorry, football. Woo. Wow. Very bad at that. You know, that's something I've never seen on a soccer field before. Sweet as. Okay, mate. Get me back to my place up the hill. I've got an esky full of VB with my name on it. Ugh. I don't know what that means either. Do, do, Br do you, do, British it, people have the worst slang. I don't know what... Apologies no, to you, our one British viewer. Do you include Cockney ry uh, rhyming slang as, as the worst slang? Mate, you are a dead set legend. She is... Right there, that's what I'm talking about. And sure, I own I may only know the slang that I see on television and in the movies. And maybe it's not representative, but Ugh. Can I can I mm. Yeah. Too petty, too petty. Let's just let's just keep going. Oh no, no, I I, I live for this. I th more than anything, I hate it so much. I couldn't even believe it was real the first time I heard it. Ooh, yeah. Let's paint the car. Actually, wow, you can't... Okay, you can afford most of these. Um, Bickies as short for... <laughs> I like that. That's very cute. Bickies is short for biscuits. Like, like come in for tea and Bickies. I don't... It's just... It makes me so mad. It just makes me so mad. There's a sound. There's a critical sound that's being elided. I just... Also... That's not what a biscuit is. As a person who really loves a biscuit. Uh, you almost have the money to buy the shortcut. Where am I actually trying to go? Okay, I see. Well, I should probably go this way. Yeah, it looks like maybe... I need to not do that. Eh. I mean, I've been doing a lot better this time than I was the... Yeah, that's true. That's Perfect absolutely episode. true. Ha! <laughs> Solid shortcut. Good technique. So I was complaining about petty things. Uh, have, you, have you painted yourself to look like the floor of a bowling alley? You know, like the lane? Okay, well, tell me what, you, what your nonsense is. What now? Uh, no, it, it happened already. You were asking... You said complaining about petty things. Oh, is that what... Oh, my paint job? Is that what the petty thing is? No, what on earth is happening right now? Hey, I don't know. all day trying to figure out where you are come on let's head back down to the city and find out what's up i'll come with you there's a back way you can take through the hills i'll show you where to go how quickly is time passing i don't know that this is not my favorite Yeah, the car doesn't uh, does not much like to seem to uh, does not much like being inclined. It would seem. No, most cars don't. But so, what's Mickey so excited about anyway, babe? Crimes. Bald guy stuff.
Honestly, that was that was pretty solid overall. You're doing a, you're doing a lot of tricky driving here. Did I get that money? You did not. You failed to fall on the cash. Especially that transparency of the building was difficult for me to figure out there. I don't know why. Where are you going? I was taking the scenic route. <laughs> okay. Love to purchase an elbow. Yeah, elbows are good. I like elbows. You know, sweetie, you have the most gorgeous elbows. bothers me that the word order in the delivery and mm -hmm. the the captions were different. She is too excited to read her script. Didn't you see the energy? The electricity positively arcing off of these performances? Okay, kid. My buddy Leo has just the thing to give you the edge on this Ronaldo creep. Mm. Look, kid. Trust me on this. It's in a container at the docks. Mm. I promised you you'd go far with me. And with this, nothing can stop you. It's primo stuff. Mm. It'll show for material. There won't be any crime because Garrett's not in this game. As we know, Garrett is the only one that does, does crime on the, on the dock. Yeah, I guess, I guess that's true. That is an established fact of reality. I just... There are only so many kinds of things that people describe as primo stuff. And yeah. I'm not sure that I'm ready for this to turn into like a heartbreaking drama about Giorgio getting hooked on heroin, is all I'm saying. What? Okay, so what are some things that you describe? What on? No. <laughs> no. Okay, that's what are some things that I would describe as primo stuff? Yeah. I would never. I would never in my life. Oh, Amabel. Don't yeah. you don't you love to raise your dongers? Wait, what are dongers? It's written on a uh, shipping container back there. It's just a, a an indelible reminder of the year that this game came out. Yeah. Like what? We're we're mostly we're mostly avoiding internet humor meme. here, but every once in a while it gets through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dong dongers, raise your dongers was a big meme around this time for whatever reason. Finally, pull up near this crane. Here's the thing about Twitch chat: it is a hive of scum and villainy, etc. I would never let my robots go there. You have robots? Well, no, but like like if I did though, I would not. Let them log on to Reddit. Okay. Maybe Blue Sky, if they're good. Yeah. Uh, they get all their chores done. This is... This is fucked? Okay. This, this seems like it's going to be... Not undoable, but a challenge the way you're rotating. If you could turn around, this would probably be easier. I don't see a way for me to turn around, though. Can you, uh, is this fence a wall or can you just like barrel through this fence? Okay, let me, um. Okay, no, that's like a really, that is a really solid fence. That's some fence. Okay, I think with a, you know, 
yeah. I was going to say reasonable application of speed. Aww. Aww. You got this. Uh, but also, you know, if, if you ever need it, <laughs> girlfriend mode is available. Yeah, I might. Let me try one more time, and then I'm gonna engage <laughs> girlfriend mode. Uh, girlfriend mode, of course, is a, a widely agreed upon term uh, in gaming parlance where you uh, have your girlfriend beat the thing for you. Yeah. Okay, girlfriend mode. Can you it's... get me past this to the next checkpoint? Hand controller to girlfriend. Here we go. Here we go. It's the, uh, this is the slow mo button. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ah, fuck off. <laughs> Mm, don't like this. Good. Leo better be right about this. Okay, kid. Get us out of here. I got work to do. Yeah, this guy's 100% organized crime. <laughs> oh, do you want to unlock a thing? I bet you could unlock a thing real quick here. Yeah. Yeah, isn't is one of the upgrades is bounce off blue tires a certain number of times, right? <laughs> you know what? I, I think I'll just do it naturally. Okay. It's... Like, I can't imagine an upgrade that I would really want other than the turtle one, unless it was like... I don't know, uh, let me decide when to turn my car. Like, that would be helpful. Rather than having to have blue tires. Sweetie. That was wrong. You already yeah. can decide when to turn your car. That's what the, that's what the wheel is for. No, the direction I rotate the car in, you smart cookie. Yeah, whoa. I don't know for sure what just what just got bitten back there, but I think we can all be confident that it was a slur. Okay, no. buddy. Give me a few to figure out what to do with this magic dust. Mm. If we get it in the system, you'll be unstoppable. I don't I help in my car. I don't want magic dust. Look at that, you're at ninety-three. Okay. There's blue tires right next to you. Okay. There you go. That's the fast way to do it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like that explanation for why it works very much. Because in, in Europe, they rotate the other direction. Cheese Weasel, I've got to get down at the memorial. The memorial? It's so happening they haven't even built it yet. Go south. This guy is definitely on magic dust. To the back My girl China's meeting me there. My girl China's a euphemism, yes? For drugs? Uh, maybe. maybe. Oh, I don't like this. We've become involved in a seedy underworld. Oh, oh, it's, um, <laughs> oh, no, that's, no, what is that called? Uh, funny. The word you're looking for is very funny. No, what I'm looking for is the, 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 the thing in physics where, you know, you have, when, when you're on a thing and it moves, you have the, um, you know, you move with the thing. Uh, inherited something? I, I don't know. It's when things are like not. Well, here's the problem. Oh, there's nothing over there. That's when things are not all rolly. You're very rolly. Look, if I was on a platform in Katamari Damacy, I would not have this problem. Well, because the that's because 
But that's because the prince himself is not roly. He has legs. And his legs work like legs. Man, is supposed to meet me here. Let's try the statue. Maybe China's an actual person? And not just a euphemism for drugs? Now I have this from Katamari Damacy stuck in my head. Good job, That's, Am Bell. You're, you're pronouncing that so correctly. Wait. What? Am I doing it wrong? No, I just said so correctly. Yeah, but when you say that usually, especially about Japanese, it means I'm saying it wrong. I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. Have you considered blowing yourself up about it? Yeah, it's always. I love you. That's not what I meant to say, but... Oh, I mean, that works. He's not here. I can't believe that China don't care about Disco Sylvain. This is bogus. Take me back to the mainland, homie. Ah. Did he just call you a homie? Is that... That feels like an anachronism. Also, I don't yep. think he has quite settled on a pronunciation for his name yet. I mean, I know some trans girls who go through that. That's okay. Can you do me a favor, sweetheart? Uh, sure. What's that? Can you look up the etymology of homie? Like, wh wh when it originated? All right. Hold on. I'm doing it. I want to make sure we're not giving di misinformation. I would, I would hate to miseducate. Yeah. All right, and what you should do during this time is just hurl yourself into the bay. Uh, wait, I can turn what I can turn what way I want. I That's correct. That you can't. You can do that. You can clearly dig it. You're my new wingman. Giorgio and Disco Sylvan are gonna go far. You need to take it easy with the pointing. Dude, the mechanic guy sent me. Uh, Mike, Michael, Mickey. Yeah, he wants to meet you at the top of the parking garage. Yeah, dude. Sweet. Parking garage. Now, this looks like people that... That, that gentleman seems trustworthy. Okay, so I, talking about anachronism. Sure. That seems very... Like, I know a lot of people in the 90s who dressed like that. Mick said something about me. Is that... Yeah, <laughs> did you? I mean, I did. I mean, yeah, but like, is that is that a is that a '70s style, really? Uh, I mean, listen, I was. I'm too young to know that. I. Okay, well, I'm just saying, like, 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 yes, there was tie dye, but that kind of beard, especially, with that tie dye, just it has a very it has a vibe, for me that is. I don't know. I'm not sure they had a they had a whole lot of attention to a period like detail like in, in this otherwise very oh, accurate right. game. Oh, I don't like this. I can't. So apparently, Homie has attestations going back to like 1886. Okay. Uh, mostly, mostly as a uh, a shortening of homeboy, which was used to mean like a, a, you know like a stay at home, kind of like an, an implication of like like a kind of a no good dim boy who couldn't figure out how to leave the nest. 
It's strange because I, I never, I never really see a uh, home, homie or homeboy used in in period pieces set in the eighteen hundreds. I wonder if it's like a Tiffany problem. I mean, they have a they have a specific att attestation here. Um, I don't know. I don't know that it was common. And then at some point, at some point, it morphed. It had. It has the. It has the sort of the morphing into something a little bit more like the way it's used now in the '40s among African Americans. So, it, I guess it would have been. It would have been a well-known thing by by the seventy, the late, sort of late '70s-ish melange we have here. Definitely not an arc. All right, man. I got your pills. Excuse me. Take two of these, and you'll feel like a psychedelic unicorn blasting off into space, but wearing a limo suit. <laughs> yeah, think about that, man. Enjoy. Hey, why does he have the brief? Okay. It's fine. I don't uh, need to know or want to know. The one thing I know about this business is, good idea not to ask a lot of questions. Hey. How you doing there? <laughs> I find this rotation very charming and and improbable. Yeah, the tire marks you're leaving behind make a lot of sense. <laughs> wow. Is that really where the nearest wrench was? No, because there's one right next to the um right next to the thing I'm trying to get to. The next mission thing. There was there's there is one, so But was that closer? I feel like I was closer to that than I was to the one I just was. Pretty sick, pretty sick. Okay, I wanna go. Should I go through this? I'll go through this, I guess. Yeah, I mean, it's a pretty wide open space. That was the sound of me having so much faith in you. Yep, I'm, I'm familiar with that sound. I hear it a lot. <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay. And do a sick jump. Oh no, that. Please. Okay. That's. That jump was really sick in the sense that uh, you died of it. So I'm assuming because of the way the checkpoints work and there's no wreckage that Georgia is not really dying. It's resetting the time timeline or something. I think that's why Beth's explosion proof it makes a lot of sense. Those are candy dots. Hello, Giorgio. Hey, pal Jeffrey. Make no bones about it. I'm excited to see you. Hooray! We did it. We earned a skeleton. I'm running behind in the roundabout triathlon. Quick, get me to the front of the pack. Just because I have no lungs doesn't mean I'm waterproof. Go get a water upgrade. I have to say I don't necessarily approve of his methods here, though. Triathlons are a sacred trust. Inflate a boat for cars. Oh, I don't like that. This, uh, this, this is not. I don't. Oh. Do you mean the the effects of the pill, quote unquote pills? Yeah, it's it's bad. I don't like it. What's a little chromatic aberration between friends? <laughs> you know, maybe this is foolish of me. I was kind of expecting there to be an animation. I don't like like a little floaty boat would inflate around the sides of the but of course not oh I sure am glad you're driving me I don't have the bones for swimming 
What? I can't make the same joke twice? Tough crowd. Nice, very smooth. Oh my, my jangly legs are still so many places behind. Time to. <laughs> Excuse me, but please do run everyone over. All right, I'm back on Jeffrey's side. If you don't want to get run over, don't join the triathlon. Amabel. Yeah. I'm not trying to tell you how to run your railroad or anything here, but there there are just so few things on this beach. Object-wise. Okay, I'm about to run over everything. And I'm not trying to discount that. I'm just saying. I ain't doing what I was. Yep, no, you're doing it. What's being told of me to do. After all, Rubio, the joy of competing is the real reward. Take me to the finish. Aww. Giorgio, you did it! You're the best! Giorgio is number one! USA! USA! Wait, wh where am I going? Oh boy. <laughs> what is... <laughs> what is the music? What is the music during these sequences? Wow, kid. That stunt you pulled at the triathlon is all over the news. I've got one last thing for you before you take him on again. We can't beat him on the road, but I have something better than roads. Head to the plaza. Is this gonna, is that another drug euphemism? Or is it a back to the future euphemism? Uh, I don't know. Is he gonna give us a Mr. Fusion? Maybe, actually I'm going to. <laughs> Switch back to something useful. Okay, you know how I feel about water levels in general. Okay, well that's just not right. You know, you know how I feel about water level. I I do. So I think it's I'm well not, documented. I'm not going to reward their desire to make you do a water level by. Um, Now, you climb water up that upgrade. art thing. Statue? Whatever. Finally, Ooh. modern art has a use. Incisive commentary from Mickey the Mechanic there. Oh, the blue collar crime guy thinks your highfalutin artistic tendencies Here's aren't worth trip. a plate of gabagool. Onto that other building. He didn't say the gabagool, but you know, that's what. The... Ah, that's it, kid. With buildings, who even needs roads anymore? It's being implied, is what I'm saying. Oh, I should have boosted that. Okay, let me try it again. Yeah, easy. You can, you can actually get quite a lot of distance off of a boost jump. Perhaps too much. 
<laughs> no. That's... Well, that that's time... Not. That time it just spawned you intersecting with a wall. That feels oh. unfair. Yeah, you gotta have a light touch. What's up? Is in the upper right corner in there, is that the goal thing? The next thing I need to hit? Uh, maybe. Not even on a building. But think about if you. But what if. I, I think you're right. <laughs> okay. What if, what, if you went, what if you went? What if you went? Take that, whoever's in that car. What if you went over the grocer co? Ah. See, you probably want to try to avoid going through a gap while you are perpendicular to your most direction yeah. of motion. Thank you, that's very helpful. You're welcome. Did you, um, did you forget to jump there? I didn't hit it in time. Nicely done, nicely done. Well, yeah, so oh. I hit some mountain. Oh, of course. Uh, then you must take the penance death. <laughs> yeah, it does seem like this would be a lot easier to do from that roof over there. Oh, okay. Just, never mind. Never mind the thing I said. I was trying to do that. No, no, no. I, the roof to the right. I was going to. I was trying to hit to the right, and I did it wrong. But. I'm mm, okay. Because you sort of, you sort of were definitely aiming for the grocer co. Is all I'm saying. No, I. There you go, that one. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. I feel like if you review the tape. Mother, some of them. You got this. This is bonkers. I think I think a clean jump from that rightmost roof, you just land right on top of it. In exactly the same way that a real life chauffeur would do it. Okay, drop me off in that alley over there. Mickey wants to be far away from this car when the plan begins which should tell you something about the plan. Kid, listen closely. Take no prisoners on this punk. Whatever you have to do, do it. <laughs> Just focus off the road and use that twist of yours to get the upper hand. You got this, champ. Finish him. Focus off the road, do the twist. Got it. Oh, You're three. so close. Okay, how can I get three? That's three cents. Yep. Yeah, if you can find one one cash pile somewhere, that would uh, absolutely do it. Done that a little smoother. <laughs> I agree. Oh, I think I see cash on the yeah. North of the Limarama. Okay. Did you 
you get your cold feet there? No, I didn't. Didn't get cold feet. I did. Did the controls bad? Which is a thing I do sometimes. I don't know. I don't think we've ever seen any evidence of that. That's very sweet. I, I do feel a lot more confident than I did. Um, yeah, like you are. You are without question um, playing a lot better. Now where was it? Yeah, it's up here. Oh, is this near where I need to be? Mm-hmm. That's also near where you need to be. Hey, uh, Giorgio, can we go somewhere private to chat? Uh oh. I know a place. Just she saw her. my murders. This place is super secluded. Just cut through the woods up here. Well, I was just thinking about the drug use. Yeah, you're right. That probably has something to do with it. Well, I was doing this better before. <laughs> what? Even are those big rabbits? Yeah, yeah, I think they're supposed to be rabbits. I don't like hey, so murdering rabbits. I saw you in the paper. You looked super strung out. Like, you've been taking some serious, um... <sighs> wow. I iced her out. This is, this is not a way to build a healthy relationship. No. I think the healthy way to build a relationship is, um... To do a bunch of let's plays together and make you fun of the uh, with a knife. how someone doesn't thief. What do you think? Uh, yes, constantly mocking your partner definitely couldn't have any out outcome other than the strengthening of the relationship. Giorgio, just pull over here. You mean a lot to me, but I can't stop worrying that the next time I see you, you'll be in a very flat coffin. I, I just can't take that kind of stress every time you drive. Beat Ronaldo, but beat him safely. Don't stoop to his level. Come home to me alive, okay? Wait, is his level drugs? Is Ronaldo on drugs? Do we know that? I don't... I don't know. I I can't follow the plot of this exploitation film at all. No. It's it's um it's probably a bit more comprehensible than most exploitation films, but you know, not by much. This reminds me of a fun a fun story. How did you even do that? I don't know. Tell, tell me your fun story. Okay. Uh, so on the film, uh, it's either Coffee or Foxy Brown. Uh, at one point, uh, one of the actors playing the two hench people uh, just didn't show up to work or left. So they just put someone else in that role for the rest of the film. And the director was like, no one ever notices, you know, that the henchman is different. So you, you can get away with that. They just think someone else is there. And I thought I found that very charming. That they're you just just have a different hedge person show up. Okay, let me go to the map. Okay, I want to get from. You just need to go down the mountain path. <sighs> okay. It's easy. Yeah. But it does require you to stop jumping into buildings. But that's what I'm good at.
Unfortunately, without there being checkpoints on this, it makes it very. I mean, um, the bottom of the the bottom of the hill is the checkpoint. Okay. I yeah. Jump. That's... Yeah. Go. 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 Ah. And now I gotta go all the way back. To you. <sighs> Girlfriend mode. Okay. Here we go. This is how you do it. Woo! What the hell? Why are you so good at games? And I am not. Kabam! Okay. Can I, can I, can I level with you? Yeah. I cannot believe that shit worked. I'm not saying... I am as surprised as anyone. I'm not saying that that clip shouldn't be your credit, your new credit scroll, but I would love it if it was. Oh, oh, oh. you are back for, I believe you Americans call it double or nothing. You're going to beat this clown and we're going to be right there with you. Let's go, kid. Your petit fun club can't help you now. This time, loser has to stop driving forever. Let's, Let's go, go Giorgio. Giorgio. I, I like I like the acting choice of her of, of Giorgio leaning forward. Mm -hmm. That's. Are you racing right now? Is that what's happening? Don't don't put pressure. On me. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> so wait, are we not doing the? Are the drugs not performance enhancing? What was the point of the drugs? <laughs> I guess I guess the the deal is we've we've decided to to take Beth's advice and not do the drugs. But the, okay, here's the here's where I am having trouble with the plot. Those drugs yeah. make us see a rad skeleton friend. So I would be doing them all the time. Regardless of whether or not I am currently racing, but especially when I am currently racing. Giorgio, he'll beat you on the road. Remember, take him off the road. Head to the mountain. But that's under construction. Giorgio, be careful. Beth's enthusiasm is hugely that carrying this game for me. Yeah. Also, how is it that we get to take him to anywhere? What is the, what are the rules of this race? Nice, nice, nice. I hope you, I hope you enjoy the route here to a mountain. Ugly. Good stuff, sweetie. Thank you. Yeah, that was smooth as hell. about the incident these days and you get a fist full of blank stares. Destroying a man's car is tantamount to treason. Yes, even if the guy behind the wheel is, and let's be honest here, a huge jerk. Some French guy. Picking leaving was tough. That, however, hit the hardest. One thing is for sure. With everything collapsing, Giorgio did the one thing. Giorgio does best. Drive. What does that mean? It's like you ran away. You drove away. We fled to the mountains. The Sorry, the, the mountain. A mountain. Yeah. Alright, well I think I think maybe this is a good place to, okay. to call it this. That's, that feels like an end of act two moment. 
I think that's going to be it for us for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Giorgio Manos is at her lowest point ever. How can she possibly recover? Come back next time to find out? Maybe. Or maybe she never will, you know? Maybe that's maybe that's where this story goes, and she just dies in infamy. That could happen. Who says that can't happen? You? I, I, no, I'm not saying that. Well, well, good. I don't think you should.